Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name is Pixelated Twix and welcome to another episode of Boundless Hidden Gems Edition. Sorry about the smacking in the background. My dog is enjoying a nice little Kong ball, little treat to keep her busy while I record anyways. So um, welcome back and today, 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 before we begin, I just want to say to the TNT Guild, thank you for many years of providing many adventures for myself and others as we go in and out of your lovely portals. I think you guys had the most streamlined portal system and no hate towards portal seekers or tuck tigs tunnels. Before you guys come at me in the comments, I just want to say, um, I, I found when I first started playing Boundless, actually I'm not even really sure now that I think about it because I, I was told that um, Boundless was, or I'm sorry, the TNT started their, um, started the, the their portal system back in 2019. I'm trying to think when I actually started playing. So I'm just gonna quickly scroll back through. Okay, so my first Boundless episode was three years ago. So it's 2023. So I'm just gonna like, okay, sorry about that. I'm just, I just wanna see, I'm just curious. Okay, so December 7th is the first time I uploaded a Boundless video. So December 7th, 2019 was my first Boundless video. So I must have started like right after or, you know, or I don't know. It was definitely after you guys started the, 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 the portal system, but you guys have obviously improved your portal system. Um, I primarily use portal seekers, but I found myself getting lost in the portal seekers and, and possibly because I was new and I didn't really know how the portal system worked and where I was going. So I ended up going through DK Mall a lot, but you guys were lifesavers when when you really streamline that portal system you're lifesavers but thank you um for the many years of many adventures like i said also um i do know that you guys are going to be sticking around tnt so it's good to hear that the guild's sticking around it's sad to hear that the portal system's going down but anyways i'm hearing also the dragon lair is taking over and um for any of you that are interested fantasia has already been moved over to dragon layer so your silver and your iron stores are safe um and yeah today i wanted to visit glovia thosa i call her glovie she and i are like that you know but um i wanted to visit her because there's two specific places that i want to visit um right through the tnt portal there seems to be a guild that's set up right there i'm not sure if it's an actual guild or if it's someone else's just build but that's the main area or the main um that's yeah the main area that you you enter into after you go through the portal from tnt and then care has settled onto the new guild care i'm not really sure if they're new or how new they are yeah they're new i don't know if they're like how new they are however not sure about the guild leader. I think the guild leader might be Chukula. However, I want to visit specifically Chukula's area. So let's get started. Let's let's get started. Uh, head through this TNT portal here and right over here to Glovi. Uh oh. Wait, wait. Token complete. Oh, okay, okay. Please let Glovi still be. Somebody tell me Glovi's still. All right, all right. I was about to see. Like, listen. I'm not ready to go be looking for Glovy now. Um, this was about to be a real short video, I'm gonna say. I miss you, I miss you already, but I can see that some of the planets have already moved. Makes me sad, you know, oh, this beautiful area is gonna be gone. I'm assuming that everything else is gonna be here, so um, that's good. I, you know, I'd hate to see that wonderful build that I, I forgot, let me just really quickly, oh, there's Dragon. So Dragon, Dragon is the guild that's handling the, um, the portals now right so i, I just want to really quickly maybe we should just you know take a just a quick gander at the portal area like real quick just look at it moment of silence okay all right so i just quickly who who did this who who uh where's okay yeah i got a hammer let's who did this who built this Mr. Nix. No, that's not right. That can be right. No, 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 no. Mr. Nix didn't build this. Gondor? Mm -hmm. Who built this? No. No. No, 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 no. 
Okay, you know what? It was somebody from HSC. It was Gondor or somebody. You can correct me in the comments. Let me know. I know somebody will let me know. Um, ooh, somebody I know is in here. Okay, so we're going to head down to Glovy and um, who, who is it up there that I know? Who, who is that? Baby Cookie. There's Baby Cookie. Okay. So, also heard some things about Ultima, but I'll let them let you know what's going on there. All right. I don't want to start in gossip or anything like that. Oh, goodness knows. I don't. All right. Through the portal. Through the portal. Um, let's switch it up. Okay. So, this is the first area that you see when you go through the TNT portal. Now, I don't know if this is going to be the same thing over in the dragon area, but if it's not, um, just so you know, this is called Stonehenge City, so you'll be able to find it somehow, somewhere. It, there's quite a few, I guess, major areas in on Globy. This is just one of them. Um, I don't want to quickly run through the city, but this is... Uh, this has caught my eye. I thought this was really cool. What really caught my eye was this hot air balloon. I thought this was absolutely stunning. I've seen this done in Minecraft, but for some reason, Palace just does it just <laughs> chef kiss much, much better than, uh, than, than Minecraft could ever. I'm sorry, Minecraft. Listen, I love you dearly. I love all your mod packs and everything else. Lord knows I love a good dungeon, but we just do it. Boundless just does it better with all the block colors. I'm sorry. We need Minecraft. You need to step up the game. Okay. Boundless. You also need to step up the game, but that's a, that's a video for another time. That's a discussion for another time. Um, but anyways, um, I love this build here. You know, I love a good Asian build. I do. I have a strong appreciation for Asian, uh, architecture. I think I've said this before in Japan, by the way, the Planet Japan, that is owned. I just now found out that Noni Pup, I think I might have mentioned this before in another video, so I, I really don't want to repeat myself, but I did find out that Noni Pup's brother, who is a twin, is that's his planet. So kudos to him for the, the Asian theme. I really like a good Asian thing, I'm telling you. Um, I've got, there's a few Asian pieces over in HOD. One day I'll show you guys HOD, but not right now. Not right now. If you do want to come over there, you feel free to come by to Seth and, and walk around. All right, so this is kind of a cool little ATM on by Science Guy. And I did notice this popcorn machine. Now, is this a Giorgio special or is this someone who decided to make their own version of the Giorgio special? Let me know. Let me know. All right, um, walking through, it's just some little cute pops of buildings here and there this is really cool didn't see this before um cute little houses um is that like a railroad it goes all the way around so there's some like someone really likes the asian you know it kind of does fit because is glovy like a pinky type i think glovy is a pinky let me see wait what am i doing Okay, it's purples, purples and mm, light red, light lilac, and night orange. Okay, so that's the color scheme over here. Like warm colors, okay. I think um, uh, Galdrian Anduin did tell me that it has warmer warmer tones. So when you see Chikula's build, I'll explain what, why he chose the colors that he did, um, but I like the little sci-fi touches here and there. Um, I should take note here because I've been kind of looking for some ideas for Neon City, my um, specific cyberpunk build, and I'm looking to try to make some futuristic video uh, videos, fut futuristic vehicles. Not sure how that's gonna go. We'll see. All right. Uh, ooh, this is cute. This is cute. Is this a? Okay, I was about to say, is this a roof? It's, I know some of y'all don't like to put roofs on your bills. So refrigerator. This is rude. I'm just going through. I'm just going through your refrigerator. All right. You know what? You don't necessarily have to coordinate the whole city. You don't coordinate. Well, the secret is you got to coordinate. Uh huh. Most people don't coordinate. So you got to coordinate. Yes, that's what you did. I like a good coordination, but this is good. This is good. I like. I like a, a, a town with a little more personality. I'm not saying that a coordinated village or town or city. Um, that 
can't be beautiful but this is this is pretty too it just looks like everyone has their own style not just looks like everyone obviously has their own style of building it works all of this just works it's not i'm not kidding okay welcome back this is care i think the name of the okay so the name of the region is named care so the name of the guild is named care is that how i i think that's how i understand that um however let me preface this tour by stating okay wait 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 let you know what i'm sorry whoa that is a close-up but let me refer back to a conversation that i had with anduin aka, AKA um um galdrian okay so let me just let me just scroll back okay okay so this build is by anduin aka galdrian and the restaurant is by frost weaver so i just wanted to make sure that you guys knew what i'm sorry about the big headed close-up you already have to look at my big head um in in the, in the, the 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 yeah the camera so okay so anyway so first and foremost um, I and Dwayne Galdrian told me that, or told us, because it was a few of us over here and some of us in Discord, that he chose the colors that he did because of the, the atmosphere on Glovey, because the atmosphere is yellow, I think he said, um, warmer colors. This is just for, you know, a little tidbit, little, little build pro tip for those of you on Glovey. Warmer colors do well under the yellow lighting. Smart smart okay so um here we are with the um the i think this is i don't know if this is i think this is her workshop i think this is chakula's workshop first of all let me just say this i love this freaking bat it is so adorable for some reason i'm trying to remember if it was a disney movie or like a pixar movie which are they're one in the same now or if it was like a um, mm, there was a cute little bat in one of the, the movies. This reminds me of that bat. I can't remember what, what Disney movie that was, though. I think he he had, like, little, um, little, like, antenna on him. Like, he would get shocked every now and then. You guys remember? Somebody let me know because I know I'm not crazy. I know I know what I know, okay? Anyways, so let's, let's, let's get on with the tour. All right, so this is her storage area. This is really cool the way this is set up. Like it's just clean, no mess, no fuss, just clean in the wall, you know? You know what you're looking at, know what you're looking for, right? Um, I love the lighting in here. I love the foliage, it goes all the way around. Like I said, the bat is really cute. And I think there was another one. Yep, that's like, there's up there. So I, I assume that Jakula likes bats. Jakula, can you tell me where your name came from? I would love to know what made you choose Jakula. What made you choose Jakula, okay? Would like to know because maybe that's something that I should know with the bats thing. Is that is that a thing? Let me know. All right. So um, anyways, so this is a work in progress over here, I think. Oh, okay, I wanna go back down there and see what's up. But okay, so it is massive and I think Aldrin is still working on this. It doesn't have a roof yet, but um, yeah, it is gorgeous. He does such an amazing job. Um, if you've ever been to his manor or have never been to his manor, please, by all means, head over to Alder through the Squatch area. And I think there's a portal to Galdrian's manor. And now that I think about it, you may have to really search. Well, I think Alder is still open in TNT. If not, I'm not sure. I'm not sure that they have a portal open in Dragon's Lair yet. But please, by all means, go to Alder. Go to Alder. Blow for Galdrian's manor. Okay, and actually, I think there might be a portal in the Reaper area too, and that portal might still be open in TNT. Mm, I don't know. Anyways, so let's step into the restaurant. All right, this is staff only, so we're gonna go through the kitchen. Um, and I love this kitchen. Is this white? This looks white. Let me just. That is white. Okay. Okay. Now we're talking. Now we're cooking with grease. We're in the kitchen cooking with grease. Um, I love this this freezer. 
the fact that there's a snowman in here. It's so cute. This is adorable. This is one of the best kitchens I've ever seen in, in Boundless. I, I really like the color scheme. Pink is not really my favorite color. Um, well, this isn't actually pink. It's luminous red. Luminous red is gorgeous. It's not really my favorite color, but I it works well in this build. And I love these white and red, like old-fashioned checkered um, floors. And then, oh, wait, 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 wait. The restaurant. How do you get to the restaurant? Is this another... Okay, this is the door out. How do you get up to the restaurant? Do you have to like, do you have to, I think I have to gravel up, don't I? Okay, you know what? Let's go up here. Wait. Oh, no, no, no. What is this? Okay, this is the actual workshop. Okay, where the machines are. Okay, so today's special is locally sourced cuddle calamari. Remember to smile. Okay. Sonríe. Smile. All right. So... I do think you have to grapple to get up here. I don't see any stairs. Maybe I'm missing something, but I'm just gonna grapple, I'm just gonna grapple. Okay, so this, like I said, was done by um, Frostweaver. Don't know who Frostweaver is, but yes. Frostweaver did the restaurant. Very cool, very romantical. Not a word, I didn't realize that. But it gives me that Valentine's Day vibe. Perfect for Valentine's Day pictures in Boundless. I don't know why I did that. But um, yeah, so this is the storage and her workshop area. Next, I wanna show you if I can remember how the heck to get up there. Okay, let me see if I can remember. Um, hmm. Let me see, I think it was up here. Oh gosh. Nope, that's glass. Wait, is this it? Um, here it is. So here is her color storage. Let me say this. I love the way she set up her color storage. It's such a different way of doing it. It's so like clean and simple. It's perfect the way she has it. And she has all the colors and she wasn't able to fit them all on one floor. But the way she has it set up, this is so cute. And I like how the gleam just naturally lights up the area. It just is so cute. And she's got all the colors here lined up. Um, I wanna say like uh, probably the top floor is where you find the first few colors. Um, so yeah, she's got this all set up. Um, okay, obviously you're not buying this, but look how she's got them everything displayed here. I, I think this is so cute. This is really cute. I love it. And I love how the colors, like I said, reflect off of the marble. Ooh, nice view. Hmm. Okay. So this is just adorable. I love her. Um, I love her color storage. Um, I have yet to build one myself, but uh, when I get brave enough, I will. And I might be coming back to get a little, a few little pointers because, like I said, this is really cute. And, oh, yeah, this is, uh, okay, these are, okay, these are the rest of the colors. Yeah, so there's no roof up here, um, but she's got some safety glass for plebs like myself who don't watch where they're going and fall off the edge of the, uh, of the, um, you know where I'm at, of the building, okay? All right, okay, so that is Chakula's Place. Again, if you want to come over and check them out, they're all on Gloviathosa, Glovi for short, um, and um, I'm not sure exactly where they are. Um, I did just like save the spot. So you may have to uh, do some walk-in um, to find them. But right now, the Glovia Thosa, um, the Glovia Thosa portal is open in TNT still. Uh, so you're welcome to give that guild um, that it has the main portal your footfall. Oh, let's come over here. I didn't even see this. This is another portion of it. Oh, this is gorgeous. Okay. Okay, so I wonder if the, all of the all of this is going to connect. Look at the stairs. This is so regal. Oh my gosh, look how pretty. Okay. 
I want to go in here. Oh, there's a door. I was about to try to grapple over this, but there was a door right there. Yeah, I really like this. Is this red? Oh, this is full-blown princess style build. This is gorgeous. I cannot wait to see this completely finished. Yes, absolutely yes. All right, so like I said before, if you're curious about where this is, if you're friends with Chakula, you know you can just portal right over here. If not, you might have to do some hunting. I'm not going to give you any specifics because it's not my business to do that. But if you find, or if you so happen to find this area, please give them your footfall. And of course, the, the guild that's right in the Globia Thosa portal, uh, you can obviously give them your footfall to explore a little. All right, thank you guys for hanging out with me. Um, I hope that you had a good time, you know, checking out these video, checking out these videos, checking out this, these places like I've been uh, for the last couple of years. I know that I took a long, long, long hiatus from Boundless and from recording, but hopefully I can start running these things out. If not every week, every other week, we'll see how that goes. I do tend to get a little busy, but I'm going to try to roll these out more often than I have been, which isn't saying much. All right. So anyways, um, like I said before, I do have a surprise planned. Hopefully I'll be able to get to that soon before it is gone. Um, but Thanks again, guys. I do hope that you enjoy the rest of your week or weekend. All right. Until next time, I've been Pixelated Twix. She is Luna Cheryl. Ciao.